Hello Aquarius, this is your weekend reading for October 21st. Take what resonates, leave the rest. I did do your weekend and your weekly video on YouTube if you want to go check it out. Tarot's Real Pop Tarot, link is in my bio. I did do all the other elements if you want to go check out uh, any other signs. If you want to cross watch any others, please feel free. Alright Spirit, what do you have for my Aquarius babies for today? Wow, that card just flew out. Spirit is like, this one! Alright, so we do have mystery coming out. You could be working on some things that you're not telling other people, or there could be other people working on things that they're not telling you. Let's see. We also have consciousness. Let's see. And caution. So... Hi. I know we got a light change here. <laughs> okay, so what I was saying is there could be something that you're working on that you're not telling other people. There could also be something going on behind the scenes that you don't know. So Spirit is saying proceed with caution. We do have the car caution card here along with the consciousness. So there is something that you need to be cautious about. Make conscious choices. We also had anger pop out. Um, you could be dealing with somebody who has underlying anger. Somebody could be coming into... There could be somebody who's like feeling pretty angry. We have the flow. Okay. So I kind of feel like that... There's something happening that you don't know is coming towards you. There there could be a person who has some things to say or they want to vent some things to you. But this is like a proceed with caution type of vibe. You know, making con conscious choices, making sure that you, you are present in the moment and you are going after or going through what it is that you want. We have anger here. You could be getting pissed off at a person for even coming at you. Or this person could be venting their anger and their pain. Um, where you could be an energy source for them to remind them to go with the flow. Um, or this is you reminding yourself to go with the flow. We have reflection. So there could be something that somebody brings to you that maybe you don't want to hear. And you're trying to go with the flow of it. And it might be reminding you to self-reflect. You know, what are you mirroring? I feel like that you're taking the energy, though, and you're turning it into something that you can create. You're the magician. You create your own reality. And you're like, how is this going to work for me? Bottom deck energy we have is love. And then we have comfort. We have charisma. Or we have cleanse. We have rest. We have peace. We have disruption. Okay, so there could be something that's going on where you're connecting with one thing or one person or one situation. And somebody's going to kind of come in. Um, I, I'm, I'm picturing it like, you know how somebody just comes in and they're making all kinds of fucking noise, slamming doors and all this and that. That's kind of what this energy feels like to me. It's like, you know what? Things were fine until you started slamming my damn door. You know, like, <laughs> I kind of feel like something's going to pop out of the blue. But you're going to, you're going to be addressing this from a very uh, adult standpoint. You're going to go with the flow. You might even listen to what they have to say. You might do some self-reflection. You might even entertain some things that they have to say. But you're going to take whatever they say and you're going to manifest it into something else. You're going to manifest something else. I almost feel like... You know when somebody tells you you're not going to be shit? It's like you're taking what they are telling you. You are self-reflecting and you're like, you know what? I'm going to take your energy and I'm going to alchemize it into me being more than shit. You know, like I'm going to prove you wrong. And so I feel like that you are going, something catapults you into a direction. It's almost like I'm going to prove to you I can cleanse. I'm going to prove to you. That I can have my own comfort. I'm going to prove to you that I can be successful in love. I can prove to you that I can build a safe environment for myself. So it's it's almost like, not that 
you don't want to do it for yourself because you are doing it for yourself. But this person kind of pushes you to do it because you have something to prove on top of it. It's kind of the vibe. We have disruption, but you're not going to let that disruption fuck with you. You still have faith. You're building your own confidence. You're even isolating and ghosting and you're working on your own success. You're not letting anybody in. You're like, stop your madness. We're having a rebirth here. So you're like, get out of my face. We have ghosting and we have trust. So you're building your own circle of trust. I mean, there's like a, a, a mixed energy of you being frustrated and getting irritated along the way. But you're balancing that shit out. Good job, Aquarius. I'm sending you so much love, light, healing, and protection. That's what I have for you for this weekend. Have a great weekend. I try to. And I will talk to you soon.